Do you want to grab your viewers' attention like the big YouTubers do? I'll show you exactly how to do that by making your captions come to life with animations. So stick around, I'm about to reveal their secrets. Hi, I'm Seb and in this CapCut series, I'm showing you how to use the free CapCut editing app to grow your personal channel fast. Let's dive into this video. For this tutorial, I'm going to add animation to the captions for this short video I'm creating. The fastest way to grow your channel and online brand in 2023 is with your short form content. You have to be able to create YouTube shorts, Instagram reels, and TikToks in a matter of minutes. If you can't produce at least five shorts a day, you're too slow. But that's where I come in. My channel is here to teach you how to make short form content faster and more efficient to grow your business in 2023. I'm going to show you different methods of animation from easier and basic one all the way to more complicated and advanced one. And I'm even going to show you how to make the text change color with every word you speak. Let's get started by generating the captions. For those who already have seen my previous videos, I will add timestamps so that you can skip immediately to the captions animation part. But for those who haven't, let's start by adding the auto captions. So we will let CapCut generate the captions for us automatically. Therefore I go to text, I click auto captions. I choose English and I press create. Okay, so now the captions are generated and I'm now going to limit the number of words on the screen to three to six words at the same time. Again, I explained in other videos how to do this. So if you have seen this, just skip to the next part of the video. So therefore what I do is I click on one of the captions, then I go to the here to the caption tab. And whenever there's more than three to six words, I just hit the return key. Okay, now it's time to stylize the text. So just click on one of the captions and then uh, you verify that apply to all is still selected. The font I use is called Montserrat. It's one of the fonts used by Alex Formosi and the font size is too big. Let's put it like that. And then we verify if the font size makes sense for uh, the entire video. Okay, let's, let's go through the text. Okay, that's pretty good. So now that we have all the text in place, it's time to start with the color animations. Okay, the first step we want to do is to change the color of the important words, the words we want to put emphasis on. The most commonly used colors are yellow, green, and red. This is the color code for the yellow. This is the color code for the green. And this is the color code for the red. Let's have a first look at the results. This is already not bad. Now, the next thing we can do is we can add animation to make the colors appear exactly when I say the words. This is a bit more tricky, it takes a bit more time, but it's usually worth the effort. But again, if you're, if you're just focusing on speed nowadays, this is already enough for most people. But now let's get into the advanced techniques. Okay, so now let's make each word appear only when I say them. For this animation, I select this part, which is perfect for that. So the way we can do this is just by duplicating this text three times. Control C, Control V works. And now what we're going to do is at the exact time that I say each word, we're going to delete some of these texts. This is when I say two. Okay, so let's do it like that. And then the final word, probably here, slow, okay. Here, we carve this like that. And now the result we have by by doing this, and we edit this here, delete each word, word, and here. So here we go. This should work. Short today, you're too slow. Now another way we can do that is by keeping the text and then making the words turn red when I say them. So let's try that now. Therefore, I just revert all my changes. So for starting, I'll need to make the entire text white. Now that everything is white, I can duplicate the text. Just Control C, Control V. So I duplicate it three times because I have three words. Then I do the same trick as before, as I, I edit exactly to where I'm speaking the words. Now, instead of removing the text, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make the spoken text in the color I want, which in this case was red. 
that would be the second point I'm going to make it this word right there. And finally, the word so in the final text. And what we have now is as follow. You're too slow. Good. There you go. So now we have the color following exactly what I say. And as you saw, it took That's a right. few seconds. Okay, now a final step in the animation of our text is to add a real animation to the text in itself. So therefore, you click on one of the captions, you go to the animations tab, and here you can select some extra animations. So one I like to use are flip up, the fastest zoom in, the fastest zoom out, the fastest all the slides, slide left, slide right, slide down, and the, those are the main ones you'll need. What I like to do as well is to change the duration and put it to 0.1 seconds. This, this will make it much more dynamic and is more suitable for shorts. Here we go, so we can do that for all our animations and then see the final results. You want to add some variation, so don't always choose the same. And here is the final result. The fastest way to grow your channel and online brand in 2023 is with your short form content. You have to be able to create YouTube shorts, Instagram reels, and TikToks in a matter of minutes. If you can't produce at least five shorts a day, you're too slow. But that's where I come in. My channel is here to teach you how to make short form content faster and more efficient to grow your business in 2023.